So, I got caught by the police there, you know, skipping the fence. And the Octagon Police of Auschwitz. Can you imagine? Maybe it was an important thing that they that they caught me. You no. Know, so I could see their Octagon badges. They're the Templars. You know, they all these guys don't know it, you know. They don't really care either. And down the river here, just 20 minute walk, that's Auschwitz. And Birkenau. And this is the town of Auschwitz and they have a cathedral and you know Poland is uh, is Catholic of course so this is important and I think I'm not really sure and I'm not really into these sort of things you know like uh, the ecclesi ecclesiastical uh, orders you know but if there is a cathedral there must be a bishop you know and that's one of the highest things they have and then what do we see here? There is a castle. And that's important. You know, that's why they have an octagon badge. I told you, for the security, it's always octagon. Believe me. Believe me now. And these are the Dukes of Auschwitz. The Dukes of Auschwitz. Let that settle in, you know. The Dukes of Auschwitz. And as we know how the aristocracy, they're all mixed up in Auschwitz. You know, it was definitely organized from Switzerland, the, ho the base of the Templars, uh, the Octagon Auschwitz police. It's still the same ruling, the same ones who are ruling, you know. But they spread the message, where is the best place to do it? To kill them all, you know. To uh, cycle and beat them all, you know. And, and these dukes here, they came up with the idea, well, let's do it here, you know, we've got the infrastructure. It's central for where most of them come from. Most of the Jews, they came from Poland and uh, Russia, you know, who got murdered. So, um, they said, well, we've got a nice place for them. It's already, it's all set, like, you know. And that's what I think happened, really. Ironic stuff on it. Well, let's have a look, shall we? It's raining, it's wet. Um, so I um, first I uh, I escaped Auschwitz the inverse way. I mean, I, I don't think I I, I should stop my uh, my idea to spend the night there. They said, "Well, if we catch you again, we have you have to stay 48 hours with us," you know. <laughs> yeah. So this Arezzo, they probably have a, a sister, a brother town, or how do you call it, friendship town, Arezzo, probably in Italy. There's a lot of medieval stuff going on there as well. Doesn't look very kosher as well, you know, you know, to stay limited within the Auschwitz linguistics. Okay, and next to the castle, well, don't, you won't believe it, there's the synagogue. They, they rebuild it, so let's have a look. Uh, there's even some more churches. So Auschwitz is not just a hole in the earth somewhere, you know, it's 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 big, you know, I've seen more churches here, it's big. And Pharaoh's here. And uh, they're the ones who uh, who did it, you know. Together with their base Switzerland, Octogon. The Octogon Auschwitz police. They even looked into my camera, they looked into my bag and everything. Uh, well, they let me keep the uh, the videos. Oh, it's okay, you know. I don't know. Thank God, it's the most important. So this is probably the most important thing here. I mean, to understand it. So these are the Dukes of Auschwitz, and they've got the same eagle as the Germans were having. You know, look at it. The Reichsadler. The Reichs Eagle. Let's have a look. So apparently it was built in the uh, 13th century. There was a time the Templars came back you know, and founded Switzerland and went all over. And uh, well, they definitely had their hands in it, you know, finding the place to do it. The, um, the nobility never went away. They became the Freemasons. And now these Freemasons, the Pharaoh, the nobility, they are 
they tell those poles, you know, to walk with, a, uh, with the octagon badge that we just saw. Well, there's the cathedral behind. Huge thing. And the camp is just down the river here. Nice spot for a castle, isn't it? Uh, there's the castle of the Dukes of Auschwitz. Ah, uh, you know, they had their fingers in it as well, you know, finding the right spot to do it. Eagles. Uh, it's raining a lot, so it's a bit hard to tape. By the way, the eagle has the Templar's colors, right, red and white. And, uh, yeah. So this is the, uh, the mayor's office of uh, Auschwitz. And look at that logo. Yeah. They got two crowns, and in each crown there is the, uh, the fleur de lis of the aristocracy. And there's even, they even have Swiss flags here. Uh, what? What's going on? So, a logo of Auschwitz, Fleur de Lys. The Dukes of Auschwitz ruling here. They're the Dukes of Auschwitz. And they still rule. <laughs> 